The BCR ABLE gene is translated into a fusion protein with enzymatic activity, the BCR ABLE tyrosine kinase. The size of the protein depends on the exact position of the breakpoint. The two main proteins that could possibly be detected are named for their respective molecular weights, P185 and P210. Whereas P185 is the major translation product in acute lymphatic leukemia, or ALL, P210 is the principal one in chronic myeloic leukemia, or CML. In addition to other domains, the BCR ABLE enzyme includes the oligomerization domain of BCR, the SH3, the SH2, and the catalytic domain of ABLE. Within its catalytic domain, there is a phosphorylation site that is important for regulating enzymatic activity. The native protein ABLE kinase consists of several structural domains. This simplified animation shows that the domains are packed in a compact tertiary structure. In this structure, the catalytic domain is stabilized in its closed state by what is called the cap domain. From the cap domain, hydrogen bonds and ionic interactions spread to the SH3 and catalytic domains. The catalytic domain of the native ABLE kinase can switch between two conformations, the closed and the open conformation. The closed conformation is not able to bind ATP. Only the open conformation of the catalytic domain is able to bind ATP and to allow enzymatic activity. The T922 translocation leads to the replacement of the cap domain of the ABLE kinase by the oligomerization domain of BCR. Consequently, the closed conformation is destabilized, while the open conformation is stabilized. There are two mechanisms that stabilize the open conformation of the catalytic domain. First, two monomers of the BCR ABLE kinase dimerize via hydrogen bonds. Second, the open conformation is stabilized, and the enzymatic activity is increased by autophosphorylation of each monomer by the other. The final result of the T922 translocation is a phosphorylated and dimerized BCR ABLE kinase with a catalytic domain in open conformation with high enzymatic activity.